Hi, my name is Janice. Welcome to my channel, Janice Ong channel. Today, I'll be talking about the art of captivating communication. How to speak in a way people want to listen. How to speak that people want to listen to you. You know, communication is actually an essential skill that impacts every aspect of our lives, whether in personal relationships, social gatherings, or professional settings. Being able to speak in a way that captures people's attention and holds their interest is a valuable asset. The ability to communicate effectively not only enhances your influence but also fosters meaningful connections with others. In this video, I'm going to share with you the key strategies to ensure that when you speak, people generally want to listen to you. Okay. The first thing you need to do is you need to be authentic and genuine. Authenticity is the foundation of compelling communications. When you speak from a place of sincerity, people can sense it and more likely to engage with what you have to say. Embrace your unique personality and share your thoughts, experiences and emotions openly. Don't be afraid to show vulnerability as it creates a sense of reliability and trust between you and your audience. Number two, you need to know your audience. Effective communications requires understanding your audience needs, interests and preferences. Tailor your message to resonate with them. Using languages and examples that are relevant to their experiences. Being attuned to their emotions and concern will demonstrate that you generally care about their perspective, making them more receptive to your words. Number three, you need to speak with clarity and confidence. Clear and conscious uh, communication is actually essential to maintain people's interests. Avoid using jargon or conflicted languages that might confuse or alienate your listeners. Organize your thoughts before speaking and present your ideas in a logical manner. Confidence is also crucial as it reassures your audience that you believe in what you are saying, making them more likely to do the same. Number four, you need to tell coupling stories. Humans are natural storytellers and listeners. We connect with narratives that resonate with all experiences and emotions. Introduce relevant anecdotes and stories into a speech to illustrate your points. Stories have the power to captivate, engage and evoke empathy allowing your audience to remember and internalize your messages. Number five, okay, you need to use effective body language. Your non-verbal cues right, play a significant role in communication. You need to maintain good posture, use appropriate gestures and make sure you have eye contact. To maintain a sense of connection with your audience. Smiling generally and showing enthusiasm about your topic will naturally draw people's attention and create a positive atmosphere. Number six. Number six, huh? Active listening. Communication is actually a two way process. Show genuine interest in what others have to say and actively listen to their thoughts and opinions. Engage in meaningful conversations, ask thoughtful questions, and provide validation to their input. When people feel heard and valued, they are more likely to reciprocate and listen attentively when you speak. Number seven, be mindful of tone and delivery. The way you deliver your message can significantly impact how it is received. Avoid sounding confrontational or arrogant 
as it can lead to resistance or disinterest. Instead, adopt a warm and friendly tone that incorporates conversation. Okay. Be mindful of your pace, volume and intonation to maintain engagement and avoid monotony. Number eight, focus on solutions and benefits. Offering practical solutions or benefits to your audience will motivate them to listen to you. Identify their pain points or concerns and address them in a constructive manner. When people see the value in what you are saying and how it can positively impact their lives, they will be more eager to pay attention. In conclusion, the ability to speak in a way that captivates and engages people is a skill that can be honed through practice and self-awareness. You need to practice quite often in speaking, public speaking. Okay, by being authentic, understanding your audience, using clear language, incorporating storytelling, employing effective uh, body languages, and actively listening, you need to listen. You can create a powerful connection with your listeners. Remember, compelling communication goes beyond words. It's about building meaningful relationship, fostering empathy, and leaving a lasting impact on those you interact with. I hope you find this video useful. If you like this video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel and do share this video with your friends as well and your family. Um, thanks for watching. If you need help in terms of your communication, you can contact me, uh, engage my services. You can visit my website anchorbizit.com. Goodbye. God bless.